Hey everyone, it's Francis Xavier, logging on to make awesome videos one at a time, and here we are with the very next episode of my Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. Uh, hold on. I have my mouse in my lap, so I accidentally clicked it by mistake. Thank goodness I didn't turn off the video. <laughs> that would have been embarrassing. Anyways, here's the team, as it is in all of its current glory. Poor Winston, I need to level him up the most, and he's gonna be no help in Sabrina. Because, you know, poison type. But Merlin is absolutely gonna come in clutch. <clears throat> and just wait until, uh. Wait, why am I walking when I could be. cycling? And as you'll notice. No more Team Rocket! I'm sort of a celebrity now. But for now, my only focus is this. Of course, Jeffrey got here for me. Well, actually, since I noticed the first trainer's Pokemon are going to be of the Slowpoke evolutionary family. Yeesh, I gotta chuck all that stuff in the PC when I get through with this. I got at least one of all the vitamins. Nice. Wait a minute. Nope. Here I am. I'll reach her easier than you think. Just because it's low level doesn't mean I can take it lightly. Slowpoke have very high special defense. Not high enough. I'm a little bit conflicted on whether or not I should have uh, Mikey learn Thunder as opposed to Thunderbolt. Yes, it's more powerful, but it's also more inaccurate. Oh, no, 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 not yet. She doesn't know agility yet. She won't learn agility until... Uh, let me refresh my memory. And by that I mean read the guidebook. Uh, won't learn agility until level 45. Level 45 is far more preferable of learning agility than... level 60. And that guy is going to have all just traditional psychic types, so... Merlin needs to be beefed up anyways. Not really. Because I can see it. 
even if I can't see it. Okay, if it's Slowpoke, then... Yeah, let's bring Mikey out. Better safe than sorry. I should not have waited until half past nine to do this. Uh. Yep. Back to Merlin. I would have tried to level up um, Sadako for this, but, um, well, let's be fair, the poison type would absolutely, her poison typing would absolutely devastate her in the face of any psychic attack. Even if Shadow Punch nailed him first. Well, you don't need to be psychic to know that. When you, when a trainer comes to a gym, they expect a gym battle with the gym leader. It's kind of a given. Oh my. Phew! I was afraid it was not going to hit there. Oh good, I was hoping to get her. A ghastly and a haunter, eh? I know how to handle this. More channelers. <sighs> See, that's what I mean. This is why I don't eat ghost types. Or at least, the only ghost type that was back here was also a poison type. Huh? <sighs> Even in Gen 3, it didn't do much. I mean, yes, Gen 3 got rid of the Gen 1 glitch that made Psyche types immune to ghost types, but the only ghost types in Gen 1 were also weak to psychic types. Wait a minute, I actually wanted to fight that guy. There, that's better.
Alright, after this... Find out how... How to get to the next spot. You're almost there, Kiwi! You're almost there! Once you're at level 45, then you have my permission to evolve. And your enemies will have my permission to die. Sorry, I had to say the line at least once. Oh, I don't want to fight Sabrina yet. I think I followed the programming. I think I followed the designs a little too close. Yup. Ooky, ooky, spooky. Here we go. <coughs> Stacy's Haunter going down. Then after this, I'm getting out of here and healing up all my EXP guys. Or, no, no. PowerPoints, my PP. Do not misconstrue those letters, or you will be experiencing a world of pain. And this little lady right here. More ghastly and haunter. Yay me. Come on, Tasha, give me that sweet special attack fodder. You know, if anybody deserves using, like, a PowerPoint up, Merlin needs definitely to have more PowerPoints for Psychic. Like, if I could, I'd use a PP Max on him. That way, that way Psychic would have just as many uses as Shadow Ball. And since they have functionally the same thing, powerful attacks that lower special defense. One must wonder why Psychic doesn't have power points to begin with. I'm pretty sure they have base, similar base powers as well. Let me check. Okay, Shadow Ball has 10 points lower. But still... Okay, let me out of here. I'm serious, let me out of here. Thank you. It's a shame this bike only goes at one speed. But no matter, in a few minutes I will have my sixth gym badge. I was not pausing because I did not know which number this was, I was pausing because I was turning and I couldn't breathe. Follow the puzzle correctly. Mm -hmm. 
And here we are. Hello, sweetheart. Yeah, if you know anything about me, you know I... I have a massive crush on Sabrina. Have been... Have had one since the original anime. I can't help myself. I am who I am. Shadow Ball! Sometimes I forget she has a Venomoth, and it's like, why would you use a Venomoth? It's a poison type. Yes, it can learn psychic moves, but it's still a poison type. It's a real shame there weren't any good bug type moves in this in in this generation, or at least I don't think. Now there just weren't any good bug type Pokemon. Alkazam versus Alkazam, mirror match. I may be two levels. Oh wait, I'm actually two levels above. Oh my. Man, if only Merlin's Shadow Ball had lowered Alkazam's special defense. Had lowered Sabrina's Alkazam's special defense. But I got that crit in! And that's it! My Poke Babe goes down. And I have my sixth gym badge. Booyah! Marsh badge, Ghetto does A. It may serve up to level po Pokemon up to level 70, but for right now, the level cap is set at a strict 52. Yeah, no worries. I'm not even raising them above 52 because, you know... Nuzlocke rules. Not that you know anything about that, sweet hat. Now get me out of here. This is it? Yes! And boom. Me. I don't think it works that way, dude. If it did, we'd all be rich. Now then. And let's deposit these items in my PC. Oops. Did not mean to deposit that full heal. We'll have to withdraw that.
Wow, three rare candies already. Wow, I've got three moonstones. I could technically evolve Batilla into Clefable, but... Mm -hmm. I already have a set team in mind. Speaking of which... Before I head off to Cinnabar Island, I'm gonna check up on Ord and see how he's doing. I deposited him in the daycare center when he was level 18. And as of now, after going through all that running in Sylphco... Come on, stupid D-pad! Wow, 1900... Wait a minute. <coughs> 190,000. Nice. <coughs> Ugh. I need some water. Wait a minute. I know I'm... That's right, I gotta pass through Diglett's... That is, if I don't want to just fly there. Which I can do because I have a flying Pokemon. I can fly pretty much everywhere except Cinnabar Island, which is obvious because I haven't been there yet. And the Pokemon League headquarters, which is also excusable because I haven't gone there yet. Ooh. A Route 21 encounter in the tall grass. <laughs> Let me check what's on the list. Now there's respawning pearls somewhere down the line. Oh, hello! I can encounter a Tangela in the grass? I haven't caught one of those, and it's the only Pokemon along this route that I can catch. Or have I already got my Route 21 encounter? I can't remember. I know I, f I know I got the crabby fishing here. I'll just fly up to Viridian City and check it out. Then I'll bike back to Pallet Town to get Ord some steps in. Let's see. I am. In I feel like I am in sore need of a new grass type. Let's see. I can also check my notes.
come come on get bigger let me see let me see I have in fact not caught anything on route 21 or route 20 or route 23 but then again route 23 is you know <clears throat> Right before you get to Pokemon League HQ, so that's excusable. All of the, so basically all I've got to collect from is Route 20, Route 21, Power Plant, Seafoam Islands, and Cinnabar Island, and the Pokemon Mansion before I get to Victory Road. But as of right now, the only place I can go are Route 20, Route 21, the Seafoam Islands, and the Power Plant. So, that means I'm good to catch me a Tangela. Which is the, which is according to the, which is according to Bulbapedia, the only Pokemon you can encounter in the tall grass. Gotta make sure I've got the right team. No. Here we go. Female level twenty-two. All right, Mikey just hit it with a weak little thunder wave. I mean, it's not like. It's not like a thunder wave is going to knock it out. Cough, cough, Torkoal. Cough, cough. Now, what's the weakest move I've got? I think I'm just gonna chuck some great balls at it. <sighs> Ooh, I don't have that many great balls. Let's just hope for the best. One. Ugh. I mean, I know Thunderbolt aren't, isn't gonna do much because it's only half as effective, but still. I don't wish to risk it, but I feel like I may have no choice. Try and let's try a Pokeball. Oh, that's not good. Maybe one little pursuit? Oh my gosh, I don't know why I was so scared. 
Okay, time to heal up. Time to heal up. For this. Actually, I don't even need to restock up on Pokeballs. I can't catch that many other Pokemon, anyways. Let's just do one more pursuit. Hope it's not a crit. Well, you quit it with the poison powder already! You're making it really hard to want to catch you, you walking spaghetti monster! Well, at least antidotes are cheap. Mm. Alright, let's try another Pokeball. Come on, old trick work. One, two, three. Booyah! Now what to call you, you unruly little gremlin? Heck, are you even viable? Nice defense, but everything else is just bleh. Heck, even your later evolution ain't that great. Ibarra Shiyazaki, hero named Vine. Uh, the Vine Hair Girl from My Hero Academia. Oh, Mother Dear. Thank you, Mom. Will do. I'll be back once I beat the league. Did that was just a, just doing that. Say, since it's all Tangela there, Tangela give high experience. Oh, Francis, you wicked genius. In fact, Draw back. I'll use this spot to grind up Kiwi until she gets to level 45. And when that's done, I'll let her evolve. I'm a genius. Why, thank you, eh? Why, thank you, boy. I know I'm a genius. Thank you for noticing. <sighs> Oh, 
Oh, look at that, just four levels away. Well, five levels away, actually. You know what I mean. No, 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 no. You're still five levels away. Maybe I should put drill pack first. Man, drill pack is one powerful move. It took me that long. And it's a level lower than the last one. Hmm. Wonder how long this is gonna take. I thought Riding of the Tall Grass was supposed to heighten wild encounters. Oh, that's gotta be the lowest one I've seen. You know, since the goal is to get Kiwi to level 45 as fast as possible, maybe using the EXP share right now isn't a good idea. I mean, yeah, I need to get Winston up too, but... Like Tokoyami put it, he who chases two hares catches neither. Okay, I take it back. That's the lowest level tangle I've seen. There we go. I'm gonna use this thing 12 more times. Before I need to recharge. I preferred if they were high experience yielding police. Like where are the level 35 ones? Come on, people. Or at least level 30. I wonder if this is what Mr. Tajiri was like when he was training his Dodrio. <laughs> well, I mean, I was all. And I only know he trained a Dodrio in the very first Pokemon game because uh, in Pokemon Origins, Red's team consisted of as Charizard and a Scyther. Lapras Charizard Scyther Lapras Jolteon Dodrio and Snorlax <sighs> because that was apparently based off of Satoshi Tajiri's very first Hall of <laughs> Hall of Fame team in Pokemon Red. And you know when the creator of Pokemon itself has that team, you know it's good. You know those Pokemon are going to be iconic. Oh no. Uh. 
I think I just dropped the book. Yep. Fell under my bed. Hold on. There, got it. And got Kiwi to level 41. No, you are not evolving. Young lady, stop that this instant. You're learning agility at level 45, and then you can evolve. Please, wait your turn. Oh, come on, a little over level 25, please. Oh, come on, please. Just one level 35 before I run out of power. Stupid analog stick. Thirty-five, please. Why do you mock me? just have to bring Homer out. Experience is still experience. <sighs> nothing. Absolutely nothing. On the plus side, this is going to get him a bunch of defense IVs. Or EVs. When my friends talk about competitive battling, Eevee is a kind of Pokemon, and Ivy is followed by Soar. Uh. <coughs> competitive Pokemon memes. I swear to Arceus. It says Tangler rare in the guide. Oh wait, that's right. This guidebook is full of inaccuracies. 
I forget what I'm talking about sometimes. Hmm. All right. Thanks, Ma. I almost think I'd have an easier time grinding of experience with the trainers along Route 21 than just sitting in the grass. By myself with Kiwi. Heck, this guy right here has nothing but a whole team of level 27 Magikarp. And he didn't give halfway decent experience. I could literally beat this guy with one hand tied behind my back. And technically one hand is pinned behind my back because I'm leaning on my bed while I'm trying to make it. Why would I need to, why would I need to switch out their magic card? Most I'm doing is getting like six speed EVs. Let's do it. Let's try drill pack. S get that sweet stab in. Get that beautiful experience. Oh, it's the number of the beast. 
Pokemon is satanic. Oh my gosh. What it is to have lived through the satanic panic of the original Pokemon. You know, my parents once read Harry Potter. The only problem... The only problem my mother ever had with Harry Potter... was J.K. Rowling being support... being supporting Dumbledore being gay for Harry. That's... that's not because of the... not just because of the pedophilia thing, but also because my mom just... Mm, my mom just doesn't like gay people. No, you're still two levels below. And I mean my real life mom, not my in game mom. Oh dear. Zap him, fry him. Uh, freeze him. Boom. And get me out of here. And back to my in game house. To my in game mom, who is, I assume, not a homophobe. Oh, hold on. It looks like it's a team battle. I'll give Winston the EXP shared just for safekeeping. Oh, mercy. Well, they are level 40. Level 33. Oh, Poodoo, I forgot. They're both water types. Ergo, water type moves will not be very effective against them. That's about all you can do. Please. Nice. I was afraid for a second that he was gonna get poisoned, po <coughs> poisoned or something. Hey, what do you know? A poil. Level 33 Cedra and a level 33 Tentacruel. Bring it on, Spence. Uh oh. I might live to regret that. Or not. I'm gonna switch out to Merlin just to be safe. Mm. 
Now I'm thinking about Jaden Squidward. Oh, whoa, hello. Just go all the way down here. A level 31 shelter and a level 31 cloister. If I'm reading this right. Oh, Poodoo. Not gonna lie, I'm afraid of that sh cloister knowing Aurora Beam. I'm not giving it a chance. Okay, seriously? How come they can use Protect twice in a row, but I can never do that? That just ain't fair. But I zapped him regardless, so... No excuse for taking it out on other people, dude. Not cool, boo-boo. What would the fishing guru say? No, I'm just gonna smack your Goldine and Sea King until he... Level up. What the? was odd. <laughs> Alright, Kiwi, you're all healed up, and there's only three trainers left on this route. Let's see if we can't get you to level 45. The only, the only thing on this route was the pearl. Level 37 Starmie, eh? Oh, darn it. Now I'm gonna have to switch into something better. Like... Mikey! Zap him. I'm gonna feel your Polyworld Tentacle and Seedra getting smacked by my awesomeness that is Kiwi. If it was a Polyrath, it would have been even more effective. I can only imagine. 
I'm almost there. I'm almost at level 44. Nice crit, girl. Way to go, Kiwi. Oh no. Of all the times for Poison Point to kick in. Hold on, girl, just wait one more level and then you can evolve. Just one more level. I'll heal you up with an antidote right now. The next battle's the last battle on the route is just a Star you in a war turtle. I'm quite good, thank you. Try attack! I just remembered something. I haven't gotten that yet, have I? I don't have a Pokemon that can use Cut on my party yet. I'll come back for you, Winston, just as soon as I get the old Amber. Wait, that's right, that's in Viridian City.
Okay, so that's a move tutor for Seismic Toss. Yeah, I know, that's why I'm canceling until... That's why I'm keeping... Uh, that's why I'm keeping Kiwi from evolving until she learns agility. I'm very scatterbrained, I'm sorry. Not now, thank you. Oh, that's neat. What room is this? So I wonder how long it'll take for him to make it. Let's see what I can buy here. Pretty much every Pokemon I can encounter in the Cinnabar Mansion has I've already encountered before. But this will be a great place to grind. Oh, is that? 
got a trainer I see that I can beat up. Take his lunch money. Uh oh. There's an item. Easy there, kiddo. Give me your two Ekans and Radikid. will just keep me company. Didn't cut it enough. Okay, that time it actually worked. <sighs> Definitely not switching out now, because it'll just use Pursuit. Besides, I already beat it. Oh, so close! Hello there, creepy statue. Drill pack it to death, get that speed UV, get that experience, and level 45! Yes, delete uproar. It's a worthless move anyway. At least for you it is. And now, you have my permission to evolve. Awesome. And now that Kiwi has fully evolved, Oh no wait, Kiwi actually needs this. Slash needs it because he needs to level up. There's only one Pokemon left here that I can possibly catch that I haven't caught already. And it's that Weezing! I was trying to catch a Grimer. Come 
on, don't knock it out, don't knock it out. Just... Well... Now this area is catch locked. No grimer for me. You know, I think I've had enough excitement for the night. It also is 10:30. No, my goodness, it's 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 quarter to quarter to 11. Well, it's going to be a different time by the time you're watching this, but that's the time that I'm recording this. And, and it's been an hour and 17 minutes. Thank you all for tuning in. Next time I'm going to be getting the secret key in the Pokemon Mansion. Which unfortunately is now catch locked. And <coughs> finding the secret key, battling Blaine, and then going to fight Giovanni. Can already taste the end of this Nuzlocke. I hope you can too. Thank you for watching. This is Francis Xavier logging off.